Chicago is rich with history everywhere you turn. Today, eyes are on the Pullman District. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman takes us on a walking tour of the Pullman homes, showing what it was like to live there in the 1800s. We are taking you back in time this morning to the Pullman District to see how workers lived and worked here in the 19th century. Now, Pullman was a model industrial town in the 19th century for the employees of George Pullman's Palace Car Company. It eventually became a neighborhood and later on a national historical park. We have been blessed to have such a wonderful tour guide along with us this morning. This is Mike Schmansky with the Pullman House Project. Mike, tell us where we are right now. Well, thank you for being here. We're in front of what we're calling the Liscato House. The house was built in 1881 as a typical worker's house, just about 900 square feet. But in doing the research, we discovered that it was the home of the first president of the Pullman Civic Organization back in 1960. And he started and led the effort to preserve, save the neighborhood from urban renewal because the city had considered demolishing all the residential properties here uh, to make way for industrial expansion. And so rather than interpreting this as an 1880s house, we're going to be doing the interior as a 1950s, 1960s house. And this will soon be part of the tour. This will soon be part of the tour, probably within the next six months. Fantastic. Mike, thank you so much for all of your knowledge this morning. And again, this is one of the only tours where you can not only see the outside of some of these historical homes, but also the inside. A lot to see, a lot to learn for all of the information. We're going to link you to that on our website, cbschicago.com. For now, reporting at the Pullman District, I'm Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News.